speak of the damn devil. Hey. Well, hello. Hey. Hey. Hi. How are you? Hey. Nice to see you again. Lovely to see you too. Love, to see you. Love the outfit. Hi, honey. How are you? You look great. Hey, the look. Teddy boy. <laughs> How are you doing, man? You all right? Yeah, that's right. I was late. No, it's all right. It's okay. We're ready for the order? Yeah. Our cuisine is Mediterranean, influenced by some spices of Middle East. Wonderful. Let's get a fatouche salad. salad. What do you guys see that you like? I would love like a, just a mixed grill. Mahamra. 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 You speak full on Arabic, right? Get him out of it. Thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. It's kidding me, Marathi. Chef Halid. That's it. Now you're showing off, kids. I don't want to be mean. Daniel, your Arabic is not that good. Here, there, I said it. The accent's bad. What do you really want to know about Daniel? Like, there's got to be some questions. Have you been to jail? I'm open book. No, I haven't. <laughs> Are you about to jail? I've never been caught. <laughs> you're the jail fetish. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> boo. Do you have 17 cats? Cats? cats I'm more person, of a dog, dog person. person. Do you believe in aliens? Yeah, I think I do, yeah. You think? I don't believe in like a green... No, no, they look like probably humans. Mark. You can educate me uh, later on on that. Are you open to being educated? I'll pencil it in. <laughs> <laughs> and they live on planet Earth? No, no, a different dimension. If I was Daniel at this moment, and she starts with the alien talk, my ass would be out the door as quick as you know. No? I've not read into that. Aliens are a big deal in my life. If you are someone I will have a relationship with, we'll be talking about this 48907. Oh, I didn't tell you. I uninvited Brooke. Why would you do that? But she called me a see you next Tuesday behind my back while I wasn't even there. She was drunk. We had built a really nice relationship, so I thought. But after I found out that she'd called me a see you next Tuesday, why on earth would I welcome her into my best friend's house? Hello? Hi. I was just thinking with everything that's been going the way it has that, you know, this probably wasn't the day to meet up. The mixed messages are just insane. Goodbye, I love you. There goes the f***ing I don't get it. How do I work with that? So no, I don't want her sitting in my best friend's house and assuming that life is okay because it's not. You need to sit down and talk, but yeah. I hope you have a lot of fun. There's not one iota in my body that gives a shit that I wasn't invited to Stanbury's little eviction party. Michael wanted you to hell out of his house. Get out. I need to have a moment to myself. I'm going to meditate. You, you do homework. I don't have homework. I'm about to have a mental breakdown. I'm not trying to overstep. I don't know if I would have uninvited her. Mm -hmm. She is going to be is really hurt about this. And then this. she's I mean, going to take it like to the devil. But the she else. should also care that she's her character. Exactly. Agreed. I'm shocked. You can't invite someone and then uninvite somebody. Even if Brooke said the see you next Tuesday, I'm pretty sure she drank a little bit too much. So don't take it at heart. She doesn't mean it. I think from what I know, is a prostitute, right? Like a cheap woman that gives vagina around a lot, no? Is that what it means? I have no idea what it means. You don't say that word, especially where we live.